Hi everyone, it's Ellie Mae with Silhouette Secrets Plus and today I have a, just a quick tutorial on something that is occurring in the Silhouette Library. This has been occurring for quite a while now. Um, it doesn't affect your actual designs, but what I'm looking at is if you notice in your software that in your library with Silhouette Designs that you see that the full thumbnail has not shown up. So on my screen, you can see that mine's showing as a green blob. Um, it can be all kinds of different things. Let me see if I can scroll down and find a different one. Um, it's not always green. It's just, it's always indicated by not seeing the full thumbnail. It looks like those two are gonna be my example in my patterns folder. Um, so we'll, I'll use these as an example and then maybe I can find some others in my library. So this started occurring in versions 4.4 of the Silhouette Library and the file itself can still be used. So if I double click on this, it will bring in my pattern. It's still a usable file. The only thing that it affects is the thumbnail image in your library. So it doesn't show you the accurate thumbnail image. So there's a couple ways you can work with this. You can click on this little square bracket that shows up on your thumbnail, and then take this design number that shows up on the information and go to the silhouettedesignstore.com and search for this file and bring up the image to see what it looks like. Or simply just double click on it and it's going to open on your design mat. Now I have patterns in this is what it opened up on my library when I started to record so that's what it showed but I'll show you an example as a file as well. It's affecting users in all different ways. It's not the same files, it's not the same images, it's completely random but it has been reported it has been sort of fixed, but it's going to depend on your software version. Now, I will say this, as of the time of the recording of this video, it is supposed to be fixed in versions 4.5 and higher. But at the time of the recording of this video, I am not recommending that all users update to versions 4.5 because there are additional bugs that I feel are worse than not being able to see the thumbnail image. While this is an annoying bug, it's not detrimental to being able to use the file. So I think it's a workable bug. Again, it affects each and every single user differently. Some people don't notice it at all, while others might notice it more. It only affects, as far as I have ever seen, it only affects Silhouette Design Store files and it just affects the thumbnail image. The file itself is just fine. If you are in version 4.5, you can try this in older software versions, but it does not always work. If you're in version 4.5, right click on the image, choose retry download, and it's going to sync. You do need to be connected to the internet for this because it has to connect to the Silhouette servers. You can see here that it showed up. So if I right click here, choose retry, you can do this and it should take and stay that way if you're in version 4.5. If you're on older software, you can try this and then close and reopen the software and see if it took effect. Again, it only affects the thumbnail image, so I don't feel it is a terrible bug. It's just one that's a visual bug. Um, there are worse bugs in the versions 4.5 that I feel are worse for users than just not being able to see the th thumbnail. So if I click retry download, it's going to sync that up. And once it's done syncing, it shows up there. Now I'm gonna come over here to my recent downloads and I'm going to, these are all my folders. I'm gonna come down here and I'm just gonna scroll through my library. I have 12,576 files in my library. So it may take a little bit. Um, what I'm looking for is those thumbnail images. And like I said, it doesn't affect all users and it's completely random for the files. So I can see that there's a couple here. Like I said, 
This one's showing like a green. It's a different green pattern even. That didn't show up on the last one. If I right click and choose retry download, it's going to sync again and then it should open up. Now, if you try to do too many at once, it's not going to take effect. So I just try to do it randomly as I'm going through my library if I see those. Um, again, it's really just one of those visual bugs. If I right click on it, retry download, it will sync up. So you can go ahead and do that if you choose to do so. Me personally, I'm switching between versions all the time, so I've noticed that it it happens on some, it comes back. Um, it's just kind of a, it's a pain in the butt is really what it is. But now you know how you can work with it. If you are currently in an older version of software and it doesn't work for you, I would just say hang tight. There's no specific reason to update for this exact purpose because your files still work. So let me find another one here. You can see there's a couple there with gray boxes. Um, again, as I'm scrolling through here, you can see that it's not all the images. It's completely random. Um, and now that I'm trying to find one, here we go, right here. This one, if I click on that little box, you can see that now it's like a gray with dots pattern. If I double click on it, it opens and it opened on top of my pattern. So it opens just fine. The file is perfectly usable. It's just the image in the Silhouette Library thumbnail. So I hope this tip has helped you. Um, it's really, it's not hard to work with. Um, and I really am not recommending the version 4.5 as of the time of the recording of this video. It's been out for a few months, but I am seeing issues there that are worse than this thumbnail bug. So hopefully those tips have helped. Check out the links in the description below for further details, and I hope you have a great day. Thank you.